Welcome to Good Mythical More. This is fitting. You clicked on this, and we're so glad that you did. Let's spend some wonderful time together doing whatever comes to our minds. And That's not how this works. And also... <laughs> Learn, learning, me. learning some amazing just just facts about animation, animations. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there you that, go. That you You'll get there that you like. But you know what? We just enjoyed that beautiful smart dog. What a beautiful smart now let's dog! Now name another pet. Oh uh, yes, this is a submission from Jen. Okay, let's see your pet, Jen. Okay. It's a black dog with a big old pink tongue. Black dog with a big old pink tongue. Pink, long and pink. I, I doubt long that, pink. I long doubt that that has the, anything to do with the name. Look how, look how big that tongue is. Duke. Duke is a good name for that dog. Duke. What about? It is one syllable, but I think it's more like, um, like, slam. 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 What is it? Gamora. Gamora. Too many syllables. Gamora the Explorer. Gamora. Is that from like Sodom and Gomorrah, you think? You think they were named after Sodom and Gomorrah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Definitely. Yeah. Or, or it could be Guardians of the Galaxy. But <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet it's Sodom and Gomorrah. Never thought about that. They have a, <laughs> You've ruined Guardians a, of the Galaxy. Have a brother named Sodom? Uh, potentially, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. Another black dog named Sodom? Yeah, po possibly, yeah. I don't know how this works. All I do Saudi know- Sadi and Gam Gam. Is that uh, when that sound plays, you're going to have to say something stupid, and the okay. thing that I would like you to say, uh, I'm just gonna whisper it to you so you can hear it from you first. But you gotta say it like do you're I, do I, you can say it like you're do I celebrating my, like a like a team. Do you thing. want me to put my hand up? You want, yeah, you yeah, just, yeah, yeah, yeah. oh yeah? yeah both put both our hands? <laughs> okay. Called about? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Say it back to me to make sure you got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> I got it. Will I remember it? No. Hey, 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 but it's. Hey, I got it. No, I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. <laughs> Why'd you say it's so unenthusiastic? No! No, I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. <laughs> is that slang for something? That's when you got a piece of poop that's just peeking out. Why would you call about it? I don't know, ask him. It's pretty dumb. <laughs> I'm not the one who called about <laughs> that's it. That's when you got a piece of poop that's hanging out. <sighs> I, well, it's not hanging out, it's peeking that out. That is when you got a piece of poop that's hanging out. It's peeking out. <laughs> Might I say, um, quite a few southern accents in today's Yeah, 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 yeah. Game. I don't know why you would call about a turtle head. That's the joke. Well. It's not something you call about. It's a piece of poop. Ask of him. I was not the one calling about the turtle head. I want you to say it with more oomph next time, though. All right. What do y'all you, you know about animations? You put an S on animation. Uh, I'm a I big felt like fan of the idea of animation. Squid billies. Squid billies. Okay. What? I didn't hear anything either one of you actually said. No, I am not the one who called about the turtle head. Right, who would do that? Who would call about that? Rick and Morty. Why do you need to call somebody about that? What's maybe, you call, maybe you call somebody because you're like, I'm gonna be late. Because. <laughs> hey boss, I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. Who was it? Does it sound like me? Yeah, I love the backstory. I was hoping this would I'm happen. I'm gonna be about a few seconds late. <laughs> uh, Something's come today. out. <laughs> a little bit. Oh, having fun this morning. Okay, I'm gonna give you a fact about animations, yeah. and you're gonna tell me if it's real or fake. By making an animated face that represents our answer. Yeah, exactly. That was something that I totally also knew. The reason that animated characters often only have four fingers is because studios save several millions of dollars. Whew. Several millions? I'm making my... So, <laughs> wait, so I have this correct. I am to interpret... <laughs> You're not gonna say anything, but I am to interpret via your face 
what your answer is. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, Rhett, you look like you're questioning. Like, you're not giving me an answer so much as a question. No. <laughs> I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can say it too. You think you, you it works think when you say it, it works. It works in, mul- in in multiple scenarios. I was saying it like I just said it. Like, did you know? Okay, so you're both saying it is true. Yeah, it is true. Yep, it's uh, millions of dollars. Yeah, Save. millions of dollars. Cut the time for the frame by frame rendering of characters by cutting off that finger. Look Which at this. one? See this right here. That millions, this thousands. Which one do they cut off? The middle finger, because it's longest. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's always the middle lo- finger. If you look at any animated hand, they chopped off the middle finger. Uh huh. Yep. Yep. Robot chicken is named after a menu item on a local Chinese restaurant's menu. <laughs> huh. Wow. Robot chicken. Definitely. (laughs) If the sound plays while you're making that face, I do feel like you need to voice it in that character. No, I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. Wasn't me. Definitely um, wasn't me. Okay, I'm interpreting. <laughs> Rhett, it was a silly little secret that this is <laughs> true. No, it's not true. It's not. <laughs> That's obviously a lie. It seemed like it, seemed like it was okay. true what you were doing. No, 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 no. Because here's what I'm saying. I'm like, no, I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. Of course okay, I am. Okay, <laughs> so you think yeah. it's false. <laughs> yes. I'm not good at faces. Link, it's not really my thing. Link thinks it's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. he thinks it's true. It's true. Don't really uh, f- and my hair we actually are having lunch from this place, Kung Pao Bistro. We were like, hey, what's this Chinese place that it's named after? And then we Googled it, and then it's Kung Pao Bistro. So now we're, we're ordering lunch from, lunch from Kung there? Pao Bistro. Yeah. Are we getting robot chicken today? Probably not. Yeah. We didn't order Isn't robot crazy? chicken. Maybe we can make a swap. Now, what Maybe is some robot turtle chicken? head? We don't. We, hold on. We did, but, but you didn't. Oh, yeah, that's weird. Y'all didn't order it. We are getting robot chicken. We are getting it. Oh, we're gonna get robot chicken for lunch. Robot chicken for everybody. Well, I mean, it's probably not that much to go around until it's gone yeah. while supplies last. All right, so we're two for two. No, I was wrong. <laughs> I'll give it to you. Okay, thanks. Um, Bob's Burgers was originally about a cannibalistic family who served the unknowing public hamburgers made out of people meat. Hmm. Why would they... Why would they do that? Why would they think that they would do that? Just so you know, I've changed my strategy. Now, I'm not trying to be the person who said the fact. I'm responding to the fact because I believe that's more logical. That's what I've been doing the whole time. Yeah. And it looks like you don't you don't believe it. Oh really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, bit. you're right. I don't believe it for one second. Um, I'm gonna. I, you know what? I'm gonna be like. <laughs> he definitely. He, his mind's blown. He okay, so it. Rhett thinks it. it's fake. I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. You can say no. I'm no, <laughs> I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. Yeah. That's important. The no is important. Uh, and you, Link thinks it's true? Why would you call about it? Okay, it's true. It's Whoa. true? Yeah. They changed it before the pilot, right? I, I mean, I'm hoping that the pilot did not have them serving people meat and then they changed it in episode two because that would be quite a swing. Um, Little Mermaid, you know, Link, your favorite uh, movie that you've seen a yeah, lot because yeah. you're... Wife loves it. Mm-hmm. Never seen it. Um, Never Jody Benson, it. the voice behind Ariel and The Little Mermaid, 
actually used a plastic fork to comb out a knot in her hair, inspiring the animators to create the iconic scene. The iconic scene of what? Her <laughs> combing her hair with a fork? Yes. You know, interestingly enough, I, uh, I took Jasper for a walk in some grasses that got all in his furs. Oh, wow. And the you only- had, You had to leave him out. The only you, thing- You can't bring him back after that. The only thing I had um, to get the grasses out of his furs was a fork. I spent like an hour huh. when we were camping. Um, oh. Using, using a fork to get the grasses out of his furs. Grasses? What kind of grasses? Like were sticky, these? sticky, prickly grasses. Like oh. burrs? And some burrs. He hated it. Then I washed the fork. No! I did not. I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. But tell me about that call yeah, yeah. that I don't I'd know like about. I'd like to hear more. Exactly, I'd like to hear tell more. Tell me about more it. about that call. Like, why would they call about it? Who call? Well, yeah, what do they say? Because it, it wasn't me, not me. Is it a doctor's office? That's that 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 is. You know, I'm gonna say the doctor's office called you back. No, the, the well, ER I wasn't the, the one. The ER called you back. I wasn't the one who called about Turtle Head. Oh, well, somebody did. Well, I, I'm sure. <laughs> I gotta find him. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure you don't. I'm sure the situation passed. I don't know, man. Sometimes sometimes they don't resolve themselves. Sometimes they just. Sometimes they don't resolve themselves. Sometimes it's just. I've, trust me, I've seen it. Back in, until you don't see it. Now yeah, you see it, now you don't. There it is again. You know David Sedaris, the, the writer? The author? I know of him. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, Very funny. Highly recommend. Very funny. Uh, his book that I'm reading right now, he talks about on tour, he always picks one thing to like collect from the audience. And this tour, he was collecting stories of uh, horror stories of things that got caught in people's butts that they yeah. had to go to the hospital for. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. And it, the list is great. Oh, yeah. But the the turtle head reminded me of. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's why I did That's yeah. why I did it. So you remember. Put turtle head up there. Yeah. Sorry. Assume your faces. What are we talking about? The, the the fork. Okay, we got a false and a true, and it's false. Oh, it's false. That was a good fake out. Yep. <laughs> Let's hear another. The Simpsons. Early draft of The Simpsons. Ned Flanders was a time-traveling salesman who kept trying to sell Homer gadgets from the future. I don't think time travel has its place in the worlds of The Simpsons. Two falses? Yeah, you're right. Yeah. You're right. Yeah, you know he, your he, Simpsons. Yeah, he was. Hello? Huh. Um, no, I am not the one who called about the turtle head. Are you sure? I think I would know. Well, yeah, but that was from this number in a very similar voice. Oh, really? Yeah, he was like... What did he say? He was First he said, I'm embarrassed about this. <laughs> yeah. I don't know who else to call. And who did he call? Who are you? <laughs> I, I'm the body shop. Okay, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You, you little fender bender. Want to bend that fender? I think fender? it's the same guy who's got the civic sport in with us right now. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, well, no, I, I was not, I was not the, what is it? It's tur he, he said he had a turtle head problem. No, but what's my, what, what, did it, what did he say? What do I say? No, I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. That's what you said at the beginning. I'm not, yeah. I'm not, I'm not the one asking about the, I, I'm not the one who asked about the turtle head. Well, he didn't ask anything about it. He just said, I mean, at first we thought it was a prank call. Because I reckon, I bet I, it was we, in in our system when the number called, it automatically brings up his account. He's got a Civic Sport in with us. Okay, uh, rear view mirror, right? Turned upside down somehow. Uh, <laughs> so he's seeing everything backwards. Well, I th that might be how he's he's assessing the turbo. <laughs> and uh, he said, "Well, while he actually said, while I've got you, you know what a turtle head is?" I was like, "Of course." He said, "Well, I got one." <laughs> Okay, and I was like, "What you you think?" You, and then did he? Do you want a discount? Did you ask? Did you ask to call 
get, did you ask to like say, give me a moment? Let me call you back. Or uh, well, why, I got, you, why are you calling? Me? I got another call. A uh, lady that's got a um, <laughs> that's got a beetle in, okay. and uh, re- re- weirdly, she's dealing with mirror issues also. Somebody switched her left and right mirrors. A little prank <laughs> action. So now they face the forward part of the car, so they don't work. Anyway, okay. I'm working on that. Forward view mirror. And mirrors. while I was talking with her, who incidentally did not have a turtle head. Uh, How do you know that? You hung up, or the, at least the guy I thought was you hung up. Somebody called from your number. Right. So, so pro- I just called back and said, Yeah, they were probably. Did you call about the turtle head? And you said, No, I was not. I didn't. I was not the one who yeah, called about the turtle head. You are not head. the one. Yeah, yeah. I am not the one. Yeah, so that's where we're at now. No, I'm not the one who called about the turtle head. Yeah. I got that right. Okay, well. Um, Let me know if you figure it out. I'm sure. I'm sure it'll pass. Why are you calling? I'm answering. (laughs) I answered. (laughs) What? Oh man. What? (laughs) Oh man. Why is who calling? We'll be at the Hollywood Improv this Thursday That's, night. That is some, that is some comedy there. Yeah, right. Yep, yep. Just look for us. There. It's, it's, it's like you got to you got to work real hard to find anything that might be a little bit funny. I thought it was all funny. <laughs> yeah, it's a little defeat. I feel a little defeated today. Mail with Jen is back for a Mythical Society special. Send in your mail by October second. 